In today's List Bomb, we cover the top eight most racist apps ever made. Number eight, Pocket God. Starting off this list is a game where you play God to the specific Islander type people called Pygmies. If you've ever played this game, even for a minute, you will fall into that fleeting temptation to secretly laugh as you torture these poor little pygmies. Number seven, I Immigrate. Though this game was approved and held its spot on the App Store for about two years, it screamed racism. What's more racist than portraying a Mexican as a rat riding a bicycle while avoiding the cops so he can fulfill his destiny in crossing the border? All while screaming like Speedy Gonzalez, who by the way is now considered too racist for TV. Number 6. Mariachi Hero Grande Apparently inspired by Guitar Hero comes a game about a gold-toothed Mexican dude in a sombrero. The goal of this game is for the Mexican to kill cockroaches to the beat while taking shots of tequila bottles. The game also features a walking tortilla chip who goes by the name of Mr. Nacho and a woman who wears too much makeup and has some of her teeth missing. The developer, as you might guess, is not Mexican. Number 5. Jew or not Jew? That is the question. This was supposedly a recreational app according to its creator, Johan Levy, who thought it would be entertaining to make an app where French politicians and celebrities could be readily identified as to whether or not they were Jews. The app was banned from the French App Store based upon the laws which restrict the sharing of religious information without consent. Number 4. Illegal Immigration – A Game an edifying experience comes along with this app, which focused on teaching the player how to identify with quickness and precision what defines immigration in form of true or false questions. It also helps to note that the creators of the app lost their son on 9-11. Number 3. Smuggle Truck – Operation Immigration Old Shimmy Labs had the ever so grand idea of making an app solely on bringing in immigrants across the border of the United States. In a rusty pickup truck, nonetheless. Not just a pickup truck, a rusty one. The joke apparently died on everyone, and it of course was rejected by Apple alongside many immigration apps. Alcherry still wanted to have their fun, so they changed the game's name to Smuggle Run and the Mexican people into fuzzy creatures. How subtle. Number 2. Microsoft's Avoid Ghetto app. As if we don't have enough discrimination, here's an app showcasing the location of the supposed scum of the earth. Though it may make sense to create an app to help people avoid wandering into an area where they might be shot or sliced, it furthers the paranoia and stigma of people living in the ghetto. Number 1. Picture Effect Magic Now this one earns today's number one spot on the list because they took it straight to town with their very blunt description of one of their hues of brown. As the picture shows, they chose to use a not so politically correct term that should have been abolished along with the practice from which it was birthed. They probably made an attempt to be funny, but it comes off as racist. The creator Lin Zhu Hua issued an apology statement saying, Feel so sorry to have expression mistake. New version will be coming soon. I guess we live, we learn, don't we? But anyway, what do you guys consider to be the most racist apps that you've ever come across? Do you know any apps that could be considered racist? Leave your comments below.